All right, well, we've got this uh, incredible locomotive unboxed, and the detail on this is just something spectacular. I mean, it really is. I, I was wondering what was inside, but it actually has details inside of what a real locomotive engine would look like on the inside. There's valves and, and uh, motor parts and controls and things. I mean, a Athern has gone like above and beyond. Now, I don't know if they've been able to, you know, combine the durability of the original product that they made uh, with this super detailing, but if they have, well, it's possible that Athern Genesis is the, uh, the king of the mountain now. I don't know how it runs though, but detail wise, it's phenomenal. We'll have to bring it around. Now, it's been in the box for 16 years. Uh, I do think someone's taken it out, though. I got it from a collection. Because when I opened up the box, although it was perfectly preserved, um, the slots for detailed parts was missing, which means I think they put them on. Likewise, uh, there were no, there's no instruction manual. So somebody's been at this before. Um, I'm not really sure... If this is the, um, no, this is not the control for it. I got the wrong control. Let me shut power off to that just so I don't. All right, let's try now. Let's see if it runs right out of the box. That's the scary part. You know, 16 years is a long time. It's not 30 like some of these other trains or 50. Ooh, she runs. A little noisy there. A little noisy. All right. You know, it could be, could need some lubrication, but see that detail in there? I don't know if you could see in there. Probably not. I need to get a flashlight in there. I mean, it's, it's unbelievable detailing. I mean, I, I've never seen better. So I've seen as good, but on brass models and some of these other ones, um, that, that have come out now. Um, I'm trying to remember the name of it. Oh, Broadway Limited. You know, pretty good. Now let's just see if it. Let's see if we can make it around the layout. There's another train up there. I, I, most trains, amazingly, are wired to go the right direction. I hope, meaning that they're going the same direction. So that other train up there is moving. I don't think it's on a collision course. Let me go over here and see what's happening. Uh-oh stuck some of the problems that is some incredible locomotive I mean the sounds okay you know what there's actual venting in there this thing's got air cooling holy crow Something happened. Oh no. Okay, just dirty track. Wow. A little noisy. That's about the only drawback. I mean, it might need some lubrication, it might need to break in. Maybe the oil inside, the grease, was starting to congeal. And maybe, just maybe, it was um, gunking up. Now she's up on the other, upper layer now. Upper level. Just coming around. 
See if I could zoom in. Inside that can. You can see the inner details in there. Ah, oh, she's doing great. That's another train, train chasing her. Oh. All right, she made it through the Dead Man Straits. Where is she now? Yeah, I gotta send the track cleaners around soon. somewhere now. I think it's over here. I hope. Nope. Oh yeah. Wow, for right out of the box, this is fantastic. And she's sounding better, too. Well, this is Bobby from Bobby's Hobbies. I uh, hope uh, that you've enjoyed uh, testing this uh, wonderful uh, old but new uh, train from Athern. And again, it is a um, an Athern Genesis CSX MP15 dash AC uh, number 1135, uh, manufactured circa 2007. So 16 years out of the box. 16 years out of the box, and um, somebody's fiddled with her in the past. I don't know if they've done anything on the inside to it. Probably should lube it up, though, get it to run even better. So by all appearances, this is a um, really, really nice locomotive. Kudos to Athern, man. So it's taken the old, sturdy, blue box, fantastic Athern, which, you know, you gotta love. Oops. And um, it's gone up a notch in terms of uh, detailing. Now, I don't know about power. And um, price has gone way up. Now, that seems to be the plague of everything now. But anyway, uh, it's a fantastic train. Super pleased, a beautiful runner, and um, the noise factor is starting to diminish. Now, it's not as quiet as this baby over here. That's a, uh, I think, a Kato. So, it's not quite the sound of the Kato, but 
um, it's damn fine. Now she's struggling a little bit, but that's more of the track than anything. Hey, she's been 16, asleep for 16 years. You know, really. I mean, I've had her in the box since 2012. So, you know. Glad I'm getting to take her out and show it to you guys and gals hopefully watching and enjoying. And, um, what is that? Oh, a stray dog. Um, thank you so much. Please uh, subscribe and uh, hit that notification button. And uh, please comment whatever ideas you have, whatever you might like to see. Um, and I'll try to get to it. And um, thank you again so much for watching. All right. Have a great evening. Bye for now.